Peace family, what's good? It's your brother God Science up in here with a new quick video. And um, I want to say shout out to all y'all that's been watching, subscribing. I really appreciate it. Um, hope y'all good and safe out there. And I just wanted to make a quick video and um, clear up some shit. First off, um, I made a video uh, probably like a week now. Um, entitled Pharaoh are you a, a, a scholar and of course I got accused of trying to bait shit between these brothers to start more shit now although I can't front that sometimes this shit is fucking entertaining I don't want to see brothers going at each other especially when the line is crossed and people are getting threatened in real time and family members are getting threatened and, and, and people feeling unsafe then you're going too far you know what I'm saying? Just like how they used to do it on hip hop, keep it on records. I guess if, if you're gonna do it, just keep it on YouTube. Now, I was talking about scholarship, and I'm sorry to all the, you know, the Pharaoh fans and all that. Um, I just don't think I, sh you know, you should get off that easy. You know what I'm saying? If um, now I'm not gonna front and say that. Shaka wasn't a little bit disrespectful in his um, presentation. I think it's, you know, that's just how it is when you're going at someone. You know what I'm saying? I don't think he, he took it to, across real personal, but he he brought forth a, a good, uh, um, you know, presentation. And it's just was just some interesting points. And and then let me other say this. Uh, I had somebody saying, you know, I'm not looking for no fucking savior outside myself. I know it ain't nobody going to save me and all the answers to life I'm going to find within myself. All right. I'm not saying I found those. I haven't say I know 100 percent how to tune into my tune in to bring out these answers. But it's a work in process. So when I'm doing these, when I'm talking about these videos, uh, these debates and things like that, it's entertainment, man. You might pick up some information here or there. If you like information, you're a history buff, things like that. Hell yeah, you know what I'm saying? Especially when history is twisted and, you know, these young kids out here, you know, they, you don't know what the fuck to believe. You know what I'm saying? A lot of this information that I learned, I go research it. It takes a while because you got to work, you know, you got to do things, take care of family and all that. But, you know, make time and you research it. And when it points out and it's like, yeah, you know, you can, you know, you can tell your kids and, you know, I mean, I remember telling my kids that about Egypt and he swear they were white because this is all he saw in fucking school. You know what I'm saying? So it's good things out of it. Now, this is not the video. I just wanted to address that. This video is about a video I saw with Brother Blue Pill and um, Brother Rich, and they brought up a great fucking point. And this is what I've been talking about, uh, like the two sides to to in the black community. Uh, they talked about this brother by the name of Ralph Smart that I've been watching for probably like four years now. Um, it's called Infinite Waters. Great channel. Learned a lot. Very positive brother. And he's succeeding and he's doing this thing and he's not going the um, the back to Africa movement or basically the, you know, focusing on white people, focusing on racism. We know it all exists, but he chooses to focus on positive things. Now, People in the, you know, uh, the other side, we're going to call him a coon. And then we have the people on the other side. The people on the other side, they uh, believe that this is not, that's not reality. You, you It's not reality. In reality, you know, we're going through shit. You know, we we, we, we are fighting this, this fucking disease called racism and how the system is set up to throw us in jail and kill us. We see the media putting shit out there with cops. I mean, it's just fucking ridiculous. And these people believe we should focus on those things to make things better. Now, the contradiction that I, that I saw and the thing that Brother Blue Pill was bringing up that that made so much sense is that when you, we, we are taught that your mind is producing reality. So if your mind is producing reality and you're focusing on this shit all day, what is going to be the outcome? You're going to start bringing that shit into existence in your cipher. So I always, this is one of the reasons why 
I mean, if you go back and you look at my videos, I brought it up. One of the reasons why I started walking out of that the so-called conscious community. And it's like, you know, we worrying about too much about what the other person is doing. And, you know, it's like, it's a, you, you know, it was all the foods are poison. Then the air is poison. Then the chemtrails. Then, um, you know, white, white man's going to get you. And I, and I said, I started to feel like I cannot be successful in this life because if I try to be successful, the white man is going to push me down with some shit. And I started looking at that. I was like, man, that, you know, I, I don't like that fucking feeling. And that was the, um, the contradiction that I saw that, Hey, you know, something ain't right. So, you know, um, that's just like, I, I don't watch the fucking news. I have family members calling me all fucking day. You see here what Donald Trump said? You see this? You see that dude get shot? It's like, I don't want to, you know, it's like sometimes you want to be in a fucking bubble. And you don't want to, you just don't want to hear no negative shit. You just don't, you know, let me, let me be um imaginative. You know what I'm saying? Let me be, you know, in a dream fucking world. And if I have to go out in a dream world, I go out in a dream world. You know what I'm saying? Other than freaking staying home, worrying 24-7 of, of if Donald Trump is going to start war with North Korea and we got to go get It's like, you know what, man? Fuck that. I just... So, I understand exactly what uh, Brother Red Pill was talking about. And this is one of the reasons why I always gravitated to Brother Rich's channel because he had different... He had brothers like... um. Oh my God, I can't believe I got forgot these brothers' name. Um, but um Minister something. <laughs> I can't believe that. Because I always watch him. But um he has a different, you know, different messages. Not not just that every all the blah 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 your food's getting poisoned and, 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 and they're after us. And, and, and it's like it gets like that after a while. So it's just cool to see that. That's something that, you know, I always thought about saying if it was only me seeing this and it was cool that they brought that up. That's that's a great point, you know. So, you know, yes, I'm not saying that you don't have to deal with reality, but focusing on that shit. I mean, I don't see the fucking thing of it. But anyway, I just wanted to do a quick and another thing. I just don't make these videos to put these brothers name in my fucking um title to get fucking views i make money other way too you know what i'm saying i make money other way so it's not like you know that's my bread and butter uh on youtube so you know i actually what i do is you watch these live streams and things like this right and sometimes you're watching these these shows and it's like damn i want to i want to um you know, I want to say something. I want to ask him a question. I want him to hear, you know, I got an answer for that. But you can't because you're not on the fucking live stream. So I'd be like, you know what? I'm going to make a video building up, building on top of that topic and putting my shit out. Now, it might not get him a lot of views if I was on their live stream, but I get to, you know, let it out and put it out there and see if anybody be like, oh, yeah, man, I was thinking the same thing. Oh, yo, that's it. So with Sonnet and these brothers talking about, you know, yes, there are people out there that's making a whole career doing that shit. But at the same time, if you bring up a good topic or you have a good show, it's called a plus bill. You know, the bill on top of that and, and put your your two piece in. Now, I'm not, not saying that it doesn't get extra views. Hell yeah, I like it to get extra views. I'm not going to say and be, but it's not the whole intention. I'm going to go put Pharaoh's name in my mind or Sonnet and just to get fucking views. Fuck that. I, I said I'll earn my shit. Yes, it takes longer. Hell yeah, it takes longer. But you know what I'm saying? I haven't passed 600 yet. But slow grind. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. Anyway, man, quick video. Didn't want to talk y'all ears off. Y'all stay safe out there. Stay fucking cool. If you down south. In Florida, oh my God, it's ridiculous. I had to go get the AC Pro and put it up in this shit because driving around with no AC, oh my God. I don't give a fuck how much melanin we got when we're supposed to absorb the sunlight. The sun feels like the fucking enemy sometimes down here. <laughs> anyway, y'all stay safe out there and bless, man. Peace.